On Wednesday, the row over the age limit between NRM and opposition lawmakers turned into a brow, which stripped Parliament of its sanity. NTV has learned that some security operatives whose names and group are still withheld recorded statements at CIID headquarters in Chibuli. No, we have received a number of them, most especially the police officers who were in Parliament at that time, who sustained injuries in the, in the fracas. They have turned up and they have made statements to that effect. On Thursday, 12 lawmakers from opposition appeared at the Crimes Intelligence and Investigations Directorate, CIID, in Chibuli, where their bond was extended till 2 p.m. today. However, all the MPs and others who had not turned up earlier on sent their lawyer, Abdul Katuntu, to represent them today. We listened to him and uh, we requested him to put whatever he had given to us, whatever he had verbally communicated to us into writing so that we can extend the bond basing on the written communication to us. Some spent the afternoon condoling with Masaka Municipality MP Matthias Mpuga, whose father Vincent Nsamba passed on today. Yeah, in any case, we also had some other things to do. We can't be just going to police making it a business. But it's not part of our business. First of all, you cannot help police to do what it's not supposed to be doing. Wherever we are going to find them, let them be on alert that wherever you are going to get them, they will be arrested because the bond they had with us has been cancelled. We don't fear arrest. If they want, even now they can come and arrest us. Ruaga North MP Moses Kasibant accuses police of staging trumped up charges. There is nowhere in the penal code where there is unlawful, wound, unlawful wounding, unlawful assault, disobeying the orders of the speaker within the chambers of parliament. If he goes to the penal code, he will find the charges. And actually, what we, those are holding charges. Some of the MPs who visited areas of convenience at CIID headquarters found them appalling. The toilet is no longer flush. They are using a bucket. They don't have uh, tiles. Water has stagnated there. They are using a broom. We have a department of engineering. That one they are going to work on it. The lawmakers who were suspended from parliament are arrested and also given bond by police are saying that they will meet their lawyers on Monday and decide whether they should appear at CIID headquarters in Chibuli to have their bonds extended or not. Earlier police had said that those who will not comply with the bond will be arrested but the MPs are still undaunted saying that they are ready for any police action. Sudil Biarhanga, NTV Chengera.